What we're about to talk about right now is uh, Broncos, uh, 22 and 23, the Bronco wild track, and you know we'll get into the 2023 20, SO9 here. It's a safety recall, and anytime you see a safety recall that has an implementation where it's a major component that operates the vehicle that you, you're utilizing to control the vehicle, they typically want you to down the vehicle until the repair has been completed, even if it's an advance notice. It sucks to the consumer because we don't know how many of the units are going to be released to repair the vehicle, what the caseload is of the dealership that's going to be working on it, if they can get to it right away, and if there's any other issues going on that may stop the process from happening. So when you have a safety recall that happens and you're at the mercy of the dealership and parts availability, um, it kind of sucks because a lot of times the manufacturer only authorizes the consumer to be taken care of for X amount of days as the vehicle um, parts become available and the car's down. So if the dealer can't get to the vehicle for a week or two, plus you've already been waiting a week, the, there's only 20 days approved for car rental unless they submit before that 20 days is up uh, for special approval, typically uh, you don't get any further coverage. So the dealership has to be on their game, the manufacturer has to be on their game, and the consumer has to be open-minded and willing to drop the vehicle off and leave it for that, for that long, or you know, even down it at your, your own house and have it towed to the dealership. Um, but in this instance, this is a major issue and let's cover it right now and we'll be back with Afterthoughts. Looking at here is we are looking at Bronco Wild Track and Raptors 2022 and 2023 made at the Michigan plant. Um, the 2022s from 30 August of 22 through 26 October of 22 and the wild track and raptors from 21 november of 22 through march 1st of 23 and it says when operating affected vehicles it is possible that the steering may lock causing a complete loss of steering control this may increase the risk of a crash and some of the affected vehicles an internal component of the steering gear may have been damaged during assembly this damage to the steering gear may result in noise, increased steering efforts, and potential, and the potential to not be able to turn the steering wheel while driving, increasing the risk of crash. Now, if we, it's an advanced notice. Dealers are approved for up to 20 days for a rental vehicle for extended service plan guidelines for dollar amounts. Rentals will only be reimbursed for the days the vehicle is at the dealership for part replacement prior approval for more than 20 rental days is required from the special service support center contract the special contact the special service support center via the sssc web contact site for consideration or approval if appropriate um do not drive demonstrate or deliver any new in-stock vehicles involved in this safety recall a dealer bulletin will be provided to the dealers the week of march 13th with additional claiming and customer handling information to support the safety recall owners are advised not to drive the affected vehicles until this repair has been completed to assist vehicle owners to have this repair completed dealers are to pro proactively Contact owners to instruct them to stop driving their vehicle. Arrange to tow the owner's vehicle to the dealership for repairs. Rentals are authorized. See rental vehicles. Re-delivery of the owner's vehicle after repairs has been completed. Then you can drive the vehicle. But until then, they do not want you driving this vehicle. So, that's pretty rough. That's, uh, that's a lot of vehicles in a short amount of time, right? sucks that we're going through this right now but you know it is what it is they're owning up to it they're fixing it that's all i can really say i just like to keep you guys informed and uh keep you in the loop with what's going on and uh <laughs> wow that's all i have to say as well y'all have a great day be blessed and i'm sorry you guys are gonna have to go through this